Hello everyone, this is Eva Golami from Agrimat Self Research Lab and in today's video I'm going to teach you how to import maps to your QGIS. So you can see this, this options up here and click on layer. Then you can see add layer, create layer and all the stuff. You want to go to add layer and then in here if you have a raster layer, you'll click on add raster layer. And if you have a vector, you will uh, add vector layer. Mostly when you want, when you, when you say a map, uh, it means that it's pixeled. It has some pixels. Uh, and it's not a vector. But in case it's a vector, you can go for it. But I will now click on add raster layer. Then in here, you just need to browse to your file, to your raster file, and then take it to QGIS. So I will select my raster and click Add. And that's it. Your raster is shown right here. Let's go to, to add a vector also. So that's my vector in here. Um, yeah, this is the vector, what I meant by vector. When you zoom in, in the vector, there is nothing, um, there is, there is no texture, like, okay? But when you zoom in a raster layer, you can see this te texture, this, these pixels. Okay, uh, it means that they are classified or they have values, but in vector you, you cannot see something like this. So that was a quick tutorial for how to import a map in QGIS. It was so simple and easy. You can also change the settings of showing this map right here. For example, I can right click and go for properties and then in here uh, in symbology uh, I can go for render type as multiband color or I can go for uh, palleted unique values and then if I click on classify and click apply you can see now I have the the six classes that um, make this map for me. So that's it for today's video. I hope you learned something new. Please don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel. I will see you in the next videos and bye.